I've just been playing catch with my son. It's something that I did with my father and now he's doing with his. When I think about playing catch with a father and a son, uh, well, I think about a thrower and a receiver. Uh, well, a receiver is, is something I think about right now because, uh, well, we're receiving gifts, but we're also throwing them. We're giving gifts. The greatest gift that's ever been given came from a father to his child. Every good and perfect gift comes down from above, from the Father of lights, with whom there is no variation or shadow due to change. What is this greatest gift that we have received? Just a few verses later it says, Therefore put away all filthiness and rampant wickedness, and receive with meekness the implanted word, which is able to save your souls. We can receive with meekness the implanted word, which is able to, able to save our souls. The word of God has been thrown down to us so that we can receive it with meekness and it be implanted. Therefore, we're going to obey, internalize what we read, and we're going to change the way we think and fall in line with what God says. As a result, righteousness will be realized. In essence, the, the verses just before this, because it says, therefore, we need to know what therefore is therefore. It says, know this, my beloved brothers, let every person be quick to hear, slow to speak, slow to anger, for the anger of man does not produce the righteousness of God. If we've received with meekness the implanted word that has saved our souls, then the result is what we throw will be righteousness. We'll be slow to speak and quick to hear. And we will make sure that what we throw is not evil in any way. In essence, if we've played catch with our father, we'll be kind. Good throw, buddy. Love you, man.